Hello, everybody. Um, I'm Young, which also means hi and bye. Uh, today we're going to talk about a couple of apps that you need to download on your phone to help you get uh, adjusted to life in Korea. Uh, number one, download the Korea Subway app, which will help you learn um, the different lines, where they begin, where they end, where to transfer, um, where to get off, where to get back on, uh, etc. Next, you download the Athe's Taxi app, which will help you um, get around. Um, you can call a taxi. Um, there's an extra fee. I think it's 1001 if you actually dispatch a taxi. Um, but you can call your taxi and uh, tell, you, tell them where to pick you up and where to drop you off. You can also text on your phone. Uh, there's like this like um, code or whatever, uh, pound, camp this, pound, pick up, and then pound, camp, or wherever you want to be dropped off. You can also do it like that. Next, the ASN Pacific app, which has radio, TV schedule, um, weather, uh, a couple of things on there. So that's a good one to have. I mainly use it for uh, the TV schedule for when I go to the gym. If I want to watch a show while I'm there, I can plan ahead or um, for the weather as well. And the WAN exchange rate is on there as well, which is pretty cool. The Waze app is a local um, Korean GPS app, which has a lot of um, things already stored in it. So it be help you get around uh, without a taxi or just kind of need some independence. Even just leaving the Daegu area, like going to uh, Camp Humphrey, you can use it for that as well. Um, Google Translate is good for when you want to communicate with locals and uh, there's a breakdown, so you can have them speak into it and you can speak into it and it'll translate back and forth. Really cool app. Um, Korea Rail, which is for the, um, it's not the subway, it's like the other one, the metro or whatever, same thing. Um, Word Power which will help you learn Korean. Um, and additionally, the regulars, Facebook, keep in contact, Skype, OSO. Um, uh, that's pretty much it. But those are all some really good um, websites or apps. Those are good apps for you to utilize and get used to Korea. Hi, y'all. Wish me